good. Okay, gotta get the little plastic clip off. Doesn't take much effort, just get it in there. So then we're gonna grab the puller, take one bolt out, put this with a little bit of stuff on it, on the tip too, like the nut. Start it. So, with the two bolts, there is one way it will go on. Okay. Size? Uh, nine sixteenths. Okay. Run them all in so that they're equal. They should be flush with the bottom. So I'm going to grab the tape measure, and just to show, this sticks out about that far, five inches, four and a half. And we're going to put a size. Can we socket size? The socket is a three quarter. The the wrench is a three quarter. Okay. It might be slightly easier if the blood. Done. Pull these off. So, do you want to stop and we'll set up for a Pointy end. Well, flip it over, go like that. There we go. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna put a drop a little. Put it on here. And yes, I'm gonna do what I always do. Not very hard. Got some pinch screws and just a little. Doesn't take much. And you don't need to worry about centering it. No, it's in a bore. So, put a screw. Got a knot. You could just cut the head off of that? No, that just threaded. Oh. And tape measure. I'll just show. Still all pretty short. Okay, so take this quarter turn. Get a bigger wrench on the body. Uh -huh. Use a bigger wrench. Yep. 
That's all it needs? That. They weren't very tight. So we're done. Hot plate, turn it on. 1500 kilowatt upside down so that the hub gets the heat. Is that it? That's it. Okay. So take a temp stick so you know it's up to temp. You get some leather gloves. The thicker the better. I still don't use the gloves directly except for the last possible minute. Tape on. Done. Oh, I don't have water. Yeah.